YouTube. Today I'm 24 weeks and I'm really excited because that means I'm six months pregnant. <sighs> Only three more months to go, give or take. Um, so yeah, I have been so tired this week. This week, I don't know, I've just been very, very, very tired and I've been having a lot of cramps. Well, no, not really. Just like I think one or two days this week I had some cramps. Um, and gas pains. I've been having a lot of gas pains too, so yeah. Um, and also a lot of Brexton Hicks contractions. I've been having maybe like seven to ten of them a day. And um, I went to my, my OB, like today's Thursday, and I went to my OB uh, on Monday. I think it was Monday. Yeah. Um, and he said, and I asked him about it, I said, is that normal? Because I looked it up and, and it does say it, it's normal, but, um, to be very careful, uh, to be very careful with them. And when I asked him about it, he says that, yes, it is normal to have about 7 to 10 a day. Um, it could, it could mean, uh, dehydration. It could also mean, um, what else did he say? I think, like, lack of, like, either too much movement or not enough movement. I'm not sure. I know one of the ones he said was dehydration, so I've been drinking a lot more water than I did before. They're still coming like seven to ten times a day. But he also said that it's normal for women to have a lot and, you know, but if I have seven to ten within an hour, then that's concerning. And to immediately call him and everything, so. But no, I haven't had, I'll have like maybe one every hour or one every two hours. Um, what else? Oh, the heat. Oh my gosh, I can't, like, where I live, it's always over 100 degrees. Like, it's always over 100 degrees. Um, and we went to a friend's house the other night, and it was, this was like, this was at night, and I couldn't breathe, I couldn't, because we were outside. And there was a breeze and everything, but, oh my gosh, the heat was just getting to me. I had to go into their house and just, like, you know, sit on the couch and just rest and relax and breathe because I couldn't, I, I was having a hard time breathing and everything. And I was drinking a lot of water and everything, so, but when people say when you're pregnant and you get hot, it's, <laughs> you get hot. Because um, I'm the, I feel like I'm cold-blooded or something because I'm always, I'm always cold. But since I've gotten pregnant, and especially this week, the heat, I've just been feeling I've, I've, like I've been getting overheated, so I've been taking it easy and everything. Um, oh, and I also, one day this week I had really bad acid reflux. I think last week I had it several times, like every other day I had bad acid reflux. But this week um, I had acid reflux just for one day. And at the OB, uh, at the, the, the doctor's appointment, uh, everything is normal, everything's perfectly fine. He gave me the, the juice to take the glucose test, but um, he told me to come back next week because it's within, I think it's, like you can't take it till after your 24 weeks. Um, so I'm 24 weeks today, so he told me to come in next week, one of the days, just to drink it, and then come in an hour later and then they'll, you know, prick my finger or whatever. I don't need to have an appointment or anything. So, that's good. And I love my OB's office because we're in and out of there within 30 minutes, every, almost every single time. Like, we never take longer than 30 minutes. You go in, you tell them that you're here, and then they call you in right away, and, you know, he sees you right away. So, it's really good. What else? Oh, one of the nights, for the very first time, Archer woke me up. He woke me up twice in one night because he was rolling around everywhere and he was kicking. But it was just for one night. It was just one night. Uh, I guess I was like, I guess he was in an uncomfortable position or something. I'm not sure because either that or I'm just a heavy sleeper and I don't feel him move. But that night I woke up twice to his movements. So, yeah, that was that actually made me take a two-hour nap the next day. I was so tired the next day because I just woke up and I mean I was able to fall right back asleep, but it wasn't like a, a sleep throughout the whole night type of thing. And also another thing, speaking of sleeping throughout the night. I haven't been getting up to go to the restroom. I think maybe once every now and then I'll get up to go to the restroom at night. But other than that, like I wake up in the morning and, you know, I have to go really, really, really bad. Um, but it doesn't wake me up. Like I don't wake up in the middle of the night to need to go. 
so, but I am drinking water, like, all night long and everything, I, like, so, or, like, especially before bed, I'll drink a lot of water, too, but I don't get up to go to the restroom. So, yeah, that's basically it for this week, and he's growing, and he's kicking, and he's moving, and he's still extremely low. He's still very low, so, yeah, hopefully eventually he'll come up higher, because I think I have 16 more weeks left before our due date. 16 more weeks, that's crazy. Wow, that's crazy. <laughs> um, so he'll be here before we know it, three more months. So yeah, that's it for 24 weeks, and I guess I'll show you guys my belly and the measurement and my weight. Okay, oh my gosh, I'm having a Braxton Hicks contraction right now. Uh, yeah, this is my 24 week belly from the front. From the side, and from the other side, and I'm going to shrink up from the front side. And this side. He's still very, very, very low. Every now and then, I might feel a kick maybe up here, but most of the time, he's kicking down here and way down there. So, and I can feel him down here. But I don't feel anything up here. Like there's nothing up here. But I feel him right here. So yeah. Let me do the measure. For 24 weeks, I am, I guess, I'd say about 36 inches. Wow. 36 inches. I'm getting bigger. What was there last week? I was 35 and a half inches, so I grew half an inch. That's crazy. So yeah, 24 weeks. 16 more weeks left to go. So let's go do my weight. Okay, for 24 weeks, I am 129.6. Wow. Last week, I think it was 127.4. So I gained two pounds. Okay. That's crazy. Okay, see you guys next week.